changes uh, for trigger warning. Some of you might already know about this, some of you might not. If you're on Twitter, go and follow Alt Feed now, or go to beta.altfeed.org and sign up to become a beta tester sometime in the next week or so. I think we're going to open that. Um, essentially, we're still going to be doing trigger warning. Nearly choked on my own saliva then. We're still going to be doing trigger warning. Oh, well, I'm just a broken old man. So yeah, still third time. Still going to be doing trigger warning. It's not going to stop. It's just falling under a new banner because we want to do more. If you've looked on the trigger warning website, Daz writes about music and gets interviews. He really, I want more. We want more of everything. But it's not just about what we want to write for you or me ranting about pedophiles or trans activists or zoo files or whoever I found on Twitter to poke fucking repeatedly for a few hours. It's not just about that. You know I like platforms. And I, I've been passionate about saying we've all got to fucking stand up. There's so much bad shit in the world. We've got to stand up to whatever it is. So it will also be not only a publisher or articles of the Trigger Warning Show of new podcasts and some other things. You'll be able to submit as a user articles for the site. Excuse me. Um, editorially, completely agnostic. We'll have a very simple rule set. That is all that will be um, used regardless of who you are, what you believe, anything else, those rules will be applied to everybody equally. There'll be no arbitrary uh, systems in place for banning. There'll be no tracking people. There'll be none of those sort of things. You know, no shadow banning, nothing like that. If we can't sort a problem out, maybe you'll leave the platform. Maybe you won't. Everything will be dealt with. Person to person where possible. So you'll be able to submit articles. You'll also be able to have your own profile on there and do all the usual social media stuff like, you know, post your activity, reply to other people's activity, share shit memes, whatever it is that you do. To increase the collaborative aspect, you can make groups. So they can be private, public, uh, or hidden. And in those groups, you can have a group-only forum that's spawned when you start the group. You can also have something called uh, group docs, which is group documents. So it's collaborative documents. You can build a knowledge base or whatever you want and keep that within the group. And you can set your own mods and all those kind of things. Also, with the radio station, we've got American Rebellion, who a uh, show that's already started. They're on tonight. I think I've scheduled it in as well. I've done very well. Midnight tonight, I believe. Well done. So midnight UK time. Midnight UK time tonight is the American Rebellion show. We've got Hodgepodge from Aphid Lip starting very soon. Of course, we have the Metal Show on a Tuesday and a Sunday from our very own Natalie Stacey. That's the interlude, which is fucking banging every week. She picks really good tunes. And also Beyond the Pale. I'm going to be starting my show within the next three weeks. I've got to get old feed opened. Um, it's got some pretty grim stuff to go on a couple of them if I'm honest with you but it gives us options so we can be assholes on trigger warning but still maybe talk to guests who won't ever come on a show called trigger warning where some fat dick starts screaming wearing a fez and laughing talking about people getting killed So your, this is the plan. Your lack of professionalism constantly offends me, Hayden. <laughs> Wait till you see how many fucks I don't give. <laughs> so that's it. It's got altfeed.org. You can go and sign up now, beta.altfeed.org. Uh, A-L-T-F-E-E-D.org. You can spell .org yourself. You're clever boys and girls. I believe in you. Sign up, and when we're getting close, we'll send you an email. Um, we'll get a username off you. We'll get you all hooked up with an account and a login. And you'll be able to go in and start fucking around. And the idea is just to give people another outlet. I know a lot of people have been kicked off medium for stuff that really I didn't understand. There's certain dissenting voices that aren't allowed. We need to create somewhere where you can do this stuff. Um, it's never going to be a video sharing site or anything like that. Down the line, we might have limited video content. We might also have it where people can spawn their own blogs from it. Not decided about yet because that's, that's an undertaking. <laughs> Um, so please do go and do go and check that out, and um, if you dig it, support it. I don't mean anything; just use it, use it, have fun with it, do what you do. Um, Trigger warnings website will be moving to a subdomain of all feed. We'll be stripping it right back. We're going to keep the forum for the handful of people that enjoy using it because I I made those guys a promise. A lot of them came from the Live League forums, and I intend to keep it until the last one stops using it. I will keep that fucking thing going because I said I would. 
Um, so we'll be moving that to there, and everything will be listed on there. It's all going to be quite complete. It's 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 progressing nicely. Still a few things to work on, but it um, it will progress. Total utter and utter says make not allowed to be offended part of the terms of service. No, no, people can be offended as they want. You just can't expect that we will always act on the fact that you are offended because uh, it'll have rules. And there'll be a charter, basically a constitution. And whilst that's never legally binding in a website sense, I, I think we have to open it up to the point where if we don't live up to our expectations, we should be called to account for it as, as, a, as a platform. Um, because it's not going to be huge, because the pressure is going to be different. We've got more leeway to do the sort of thing I really can do when you haven't got those other pressures on you. And um, I hope it works. If it doesn't, well, we, we tried. I'd rather fail than not try at all. So do do come and join us, and uh, that'd be really helpful. Um, wh what accident with our Christmas lights? Graham rearranged them to look beautiful. I fucking dare you. I grafted hard on those lights this evening. Thank you very much. My fez is 